The hardest thing living with PKD is knowing that someday my kidneys, there's a high chance my kidneys are going to fail. Um, and just waiting for that to happen. I live with Craig, my husband, who has PKD. We've got three boys together. Evan is 12, Kian is 10, and Charlie's five, and Charlie was born with PKD. Growing up, my sister was always really ill, and over the years, her kidneys deteriorated at quite a rate, so in her early 20s, she had to have a kidney transplant. She was having a kidney transplant, um, and he wanted to be a donor, so he went for the appointment to check that his kidneys were healthy. Um, and during the ultrasound, he got told by the um, doctor that he too has PKD. At the time, I was probably more gutted that I couldn't help my sister, but it, it dawned on me later on how serious it was for m myself uh, and my family. Every time I go for a checkup, is it going to be the time? Is he going to tell me that? My, my kidneys are deteriorating and it's going to be time for dialysis. That, that's a big fear. My worst feeling is that my young son, Charlie, has the disease. When I first found out he'd got PKD, um, my response straight away was um, guilt. I felt really guilty that we'd decided to have a baby knowing that PKD runs in Craig's family. Just a horrible feeling of guilt of knowing that it was my fault that, that he was going to be born with polycystic kidney disease. But then I look at him and he's beautiful and he's perfect. It's just I know what's inside, which upsets me. Mentally, it's possibly one of the worst things ever to try and cope with knowing that you've got a little boy that you, you love and he's not healthy, he's got PKD. I felt like my world had ended. It's just unpredictability. Uh, and waiting. I kind of refocused my mind onto fundraising for the charity. Uh, done seven or eight half marathons, um, done a couple of 15 miles and 16 mile runs, um, lots of 10k races and then I organised my own charity fun run which was called um, Charlie's Fun Run and that raised um, just under a thousand pounds for the charity. My message to people who are currently fundraising for kidney research and polycystic kidney disease is just to keep doing what you're doing. It's massively appreciated uh, for my family and millions of other families. Great awareness of PKD would hopefully lead to more fundraising which would lead to more publicity and a cure. Just because you can't see that people are suffering with their kidneys, it doesn't mean to say that they aren't suffering. The ultimate aim is, is to find a cure for this disease um, so my son can lead a, a normal life. <laughs>